What's up guys, Bobcat here, and welcome back to Medieval 2 Total War. Last time, we got into a war with the HRE. We fought off their army a few times. As well as a war with um, Denmark as well. And we have to blockade their port while we're at it. Got eight turns to do that though, so... Not a problem. <clears throat> we also joined the Crusade. Bit concerned about what's going to happen there. Considering he's in the middle of the ocean, and there's the Moors, but... Uh, I don't think they'll attack me. Um, I don't think there's anything else for me to do either. Oh, hello. Hang on. Are the Spanish and the... Oh my god, look at everyone I'm at war with. Are the Spanish and the French at war? No, but it looks like they might be. Oh yeah, I forgot I was sending you up there to get peace with them after the Crusade's done. <clears throat> what else? Yeah, that big French army of peasants. You know, thankfully, because we're on the Crusade, we're... N we're, we're, we're Try this again, shall we? Because we're on the Crusades, we're actually earning quite a lot of money because we're not paying upkeep for a fairly sizable uh, group of troops. So, that's good. Hopefully we can put that forward. Uh, sure, you seem very good. 34. Hey, our Pope is dead. That's a shame. Hmm, okay. <laughs> okay. A Sicilian Pope. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to give it to uh, the Papal States. Yep. It's funny. I think the AI is most likely to vote where you voted. Unless you're at war with them. Or there's something like, very specific. So this is... Yeah, this guy just came in over here, which is actually really good. Because I can use him to deal with the French. Where's my spy? Where to, sir? Just move close. I want to see what he has. Oh, that's bog all. Peasants. You know, I'm sure there's a version of peasants that have bonuses versus cavalry. I'm sure of it. Yep, relations improved. Someone feels unappreciated. He's still loyal for the time being. Now we have 3,000 gold, so we need to spend that. Really wish this place would grow. Ah, he's getting close. So hopefully we'll be able to build um, armoured swordsmen soon. In the meantime, more archers. And we'll get some more billmen while we're at it. Uh, our navy didn't get attacked. Oh boy. That's not what you want to see. <clears throat> well, we can drop our troops off right at Tunis. Uh, is the crusade still going on? It is. Uh, you know what? Just drop off at Tunis. Taking the troops ashore, sire. Hail, my king. Hey, the Pope likes me. By your will, sire, we shall engage. There's note there, so that should be done next turn. It's a shame our relations are falling, but oh well. Yes, my lord. <clears throat> I think our cardinals got promoted. Question, sire. Uh, Hungary and Sicily, yep. Yeah. Something happened with the Danes, and I wasn't paying attention to what that said. Yes, my lord. Uh, try communicate with this guy, Captain Valdemar. Tomorrow's journey plan. Engage me or be gone. You will have to fight. Yeah, the Danes do have um, better ships than we do. Get out of my way. Hey, it looks like the Danes are actually uh, conquering. Well, uh, Stockholm and Oslo. Construction. Very nice. Got dirt roads up here. Wonderful. Turn that off. <clears throat> Hope that hasn't been on since last turn. Um, I mean, this is probably going to be converted into a city, so I shouldn't worry too much. Let's just convert it now. As long as we have roads, it shouldn't be so much of a problem. Go down there. Hey, people came of age. Excellent. More people down here. Ooh, you're very unhappy. What happened? Um, I'm not sure what happened, but something did. A lot of the taxes. Probably just lack of troops. I imagine that's what's wrong. <clears throat> right, build me some archer militia, because it's cheaper than the other stuff. Hail, my king. You keep on going down. As you will, my king. I have to build a watchtower next turn. Hail, my king. So we can keep an eye on our areas around Hail us. Max. You head to the Papal States, because I don't Searching have trade routes with the Pope yet. Which is kind of strange. 
I do want to go after that at some point as well. Once we build up enough forces, we'll send out probably Davy, Davy Cromwell, and have him go and romp across uh, France. <clears throat> I really want, bleh, I really want to take Angus first because Angus is actually pretty good. In fact, it's got a knight stable as well, and a drill square. So that's actually very important. Taking out Angus soon is going to be important. Well, ideally the sooner the better, but we'll have to wait and see. <clears throat> after we're doing the Crusades, I'll probably march out a cairn and go straight after it. <clears throat> if I can take Angus, that's going to help out a lot. Someone just dropped dead. It's about time that happened, we're 57 turns in. In fact, William the Conqueror died a while ago now. That army worries me a tad. Have a look at it. Pilgrims. Um, okay, Milan likes me. <coughs> Denmark got promoted. More people at war with Sicily. Recruitment done. Merchant's Wharf in London, very nice. Robert is feeling unappreciated. Well, you're going to drop dead soon, so I'm not too concerned. Such things happen when you are 52. I want to build an inn there, actually. Because <clears throat> I think when he dies, the governance is going to have some problems. We're the strongest faction again. Oh, we detected an agent. So we didn't lose a family member, it was us killing a Dane. Fair enough. That's a Polish diplomat. Let's go see if they want peace. Really? I'm surprised. What's this army? Okay, more dismounted feudal knights and no swordsmen. Little concerning, not gonna lie. Put that under blockade, we'll get best units available. So, bog all then, I guess. Probably male knights. Maybe Bielman. We'll see. Um, get me these two. We'll siege Tunis for one more turn, then we'll go in. Because we can take most of these troops out then and march against the, uh... Oh, hello. I look forward to fighting you. Hmm. I really should get a town guard there, shouldn't I? Cancel that guy. Can I build a town guard there now? I can. Get it. That'll let me actually build spearmen. You keep on coming down. I'll have to get paved roads soon as well. But I am so starved for money. It happens. Now I can do about it. Have you moved? You did. I was supposed to build watchtowers. I'll just have to build one next turn. They were a bit unhappy as well, actually. Hmm. Well. Oh, I forgot about the Pope. Trade rights. It seems we have reached this concludes our meeting, yes? Should give me some more money. <clears throat> Don't know how much, but it'll give me something. You know, I might try and drop the Milanese into this war. Hmm. I'm worried about what Denmark's gonna do as well, though. I think we've been past no we haven't been past Denmark yet, because their troops haven't moved. Here they come. Will they attack me? Most likely. Yep. <clears throat> like I suspected. You take your time. My liege, we must make a stand. We are besieged. Uh, okay. Interesting path he's taking. I mean, I don't know why he thinks he can win. I mean, yeah, he has got some decent-looking units. Um, suitable prince, fair fighter. Loyalty's not very good, but he's 28, so sure. What was his name? Edward? No, Edmund. Edmund Moore. Moore's, even. Sure. Yep. Mission successful, we've got three units of mailed knights. Oh, jeez. Give me a ship so I can move them over. Command me, sire. So many mailed knights. I'll just have to disperse them throughout all the uh, different areas. Ken can upgrade. Milan's the strongest faction. Okay. Down over in Tunis. Should we just get this over and done with? Your Majesty. Approaching their dignitary, sire. It would be sensible just to get it done with now, rather than dawdling. Also got to deal with this guy. 
Ooh, actually, I think he will pull this guy in. Uh, let's blend some of these guys together. Better to have some more units, some more, well, some stronger units than more of them. Uh, hang on. Hmm. Want to blend these mailed knights? Not really. Let's uh, just do this. Oh, we didn't pull that guy in. Excellent. Just this amount of feudals. Um, <clears throat> they, no, they've got good armor. It's a shame we don't have Billman here. So our archers are only going to be so useful. Okay. Oops. Mucked that up. Did not mean to do that. Are they moving away or are they going to stand there? No, they're moving backwards. Fair enough. Where was the other battle I had? Was it here? I think it must have been. Everybody run. The longbow's out. If I'd have put a unit on the walls, we could have obviously gained a few uh, free kills there, but oh well. Group up. Move forward. New lot moving behind them. Have to do a bit more of a sort out of this lot. In fact, there's no point in doing anything fancy because they don't have any cavalry, so they're not going to come around the sides. Our goal should be encirclement as quickly and efficiently as possible. You two go this side. You go that side. Group up. Everybody move forward to like here, maybe. Might not be the best position. I think there's a bit of a hill there, actually, isn't there? Hmm. Bit of a hill. But if they're not going to turn and face me, that means I get free archer shots on them, so I'll take it. Let's see, how much do we do? Yeah, I killed a decent number of them. It's a bit difficult, because don't, I don't think we're effective versus armor. If these were Sherwood archers, then that would change things. Or even, I think, some of our later armor. Later armor. Later range units. Like our retinue longbows, I think. Have uh, bonuses versus armor, but I'm not sure. You know, given how shaken they are, they might actually just break. Target them now. Oh yeah, they just broke instantly. Um, you go mop them up. Come on, lads, get through. I think we're also on a bit of a slope, which doesn't help. Yeah, it'd be better if we were a bit more centralised. Would help out a lot. Don't get caught by the uh, dismount of feudals. Let's take you out of the group. And let's move the group up here so we're not shooting downhill as much. Because that shooting downhill is... Well, having to shoot uphill isn't uh, the most sensible. What are you doing? Come over here. Nearly blew ran into that group of dismount of feudals. That would have been the end of them. Put it back up to time six. I don't know what you're doing there, but okay, come over here. Firing away at this guy who's not facing me for some reason, so free kills for me. <clears throat> I also have it 15 minutes, so I'll have to put a cut in in a second. In fact, I'll just do it now. Okay, continuing. There you 
go start plonking at them. You know, so far the only casualties we've taken are some of our own levy spearmen, which we shot. <laughs> Yeah, you can hear some of the arrows pinging off their armour. Well, so far so good. We will finish off them for the time being. <clears throat> Do what might. Oh, never mind. Broken already. You two go after them. You three reform. Oh yes. Turn away from my arch. Well, turn away from my archers so you get shot in the back. How is that working out for you? In our favor. If we remain true and Ooh, stand where's my general? Will be ours. He is there at the front, so he'll be alright for the time being. How our there we go. You lot cease fire. Oh, we lost one guy. I think he got hit with arrows. Oh well, it happens. Go get vengeance. <laughs> Enemy general. This went much better than I expected. I honestly expected them to charge me, but they just kind of stood there. Which, hey, that works for me. All of Christendom will be awed by the victory Thank we you. Won here today. Um. Yes, you earned the ransom, Lord. Take it. Didn't expect it to work. Do you want peace yet? Peace you have come to ask for. Hmm, they're strong but bankrupt. Then again, we're not much better. Ready, Where do those troops come from? Because you can only build those from forts, unless that's a fort. Ah, it is a fortress, Hamburg. Looks like it was converted. Okay, <clears throat> the Spaniards are Speak to our concerning me. We have tons of generals here, so let's finish off the Crusades and then go and attack the French. Hail my king. By your will, sire, we shall engage. It's a fortress as well, it's that, so I'll be keeping it. By God's will, we Ooh, have triumphed. 11,000? Yes, God please. Be praised. He has granted us yep. victory. Where new expands, got a Templar Knight, a Hospitalia Knight, and more chivalry. Yep. What is it? Gregory the Crusader. Oh, we can build Knight Hospitalia here and mailed knights. This is a blooming good. S yeah, it's a blooming good one. Uh, it doesn't have the barracks yet, but that's not a problem. Yeah, we can't retrain those because we just took the city. But we got 14,000 gold. Which is lovely. Um. None of this deals with corruption, sadly. Which does suck. Still, I can actually spend all this money back home, improving things around here. <clears throat> For example, Merchant's Wharfs. You need 6,000, so your miles are growing yet. Um, Merchant's Wharf. Well, town hall to up mines. Let's get mines. They pay for themselves pretty effectively. You grow up. Grow up, I almost said. Well, he still needs to do that anyway. Needs to grow. We'll get that. <clears throat> okay. Second plan is to attack the French. So, I guess we'll take you two. Maybe just one, actually. Uh, we'll take you, because you're suffering from a bit of loyalty Sire. issues. Orders. Orders. Sire. Take the billmen. Sire. Take some Sire. of them. Orders. Sire. My Lord. Take most of that lot. Do I want to have to Paris, actually? Mm. 
I'm not sure I want to go after Paris. Do need to build more troops here now. But it won't take long to rebuild that lot. Oh, we might have economic problems next turn, though. Well, we'll just take France. <laughs> I say France. Take it, Angus. And then we'll go against Paris, I think. Uh, yeah, I think we'll be alright. Like yep. We lay siege. The siege right, what with Venice now? Sire. Uh, no, I'm just at war with French. <laughs> just at war with French. Yes, not the, not the, not the Sire. French, just French. Uh, how are you looking in terms of religion, actually? Okay. Get a priest there as well while we're at it. No sense in not doing it. Let's see how bad the economic situation has gone. Oh, I forgot about this. Ooh, you're heretic. Gonna have to get rid of him. Okay, Polish diplomat, what do you want? Alliance from Poland? Hey, we have the same enemies. Sure. We shall not soon for another course of wisdom to share. Do not think our people accept this will okay. your time was Calm down. Valuable. We thank you. Um oh, cease hostilities. My Lord. <sighs> Fine. I throw down the gauntlet to you. Accept I'll cease tenet. hostilities for the time being, Mr. Pop. Hey, nice, thank you. I may not have to. I don't think I'll be excommunicated. But I'm not sure. Well, man, the Pope are at war. Uh, Spanish, well, the Spanish appear to be trying the same thing they tried last turn. Yeah, we are hurting in terms of uh, money. And I said last turn. It was a while ago now. Hey, a merchant died. Oh, he died up there. I have to build a new one down in Egypt. Um, let's see how badly this goes. If we're excommunicated or not. Because we're currently at the top, I think. Eh. 8 out of 10. Let's see what happens. Wow, he can... He's really supporting himself there, isn't he? Hmm. Victory is ours, sire. As you commanded, okay. sire, these lands are now How bad yours. are we looking, though? Oh, one point? That's all? Fr France can eat it, then. I ain't losing that. Gladly take those losses. I can even get this amount of feudals now. Uh, it's not worth it, though. Because I'm much better with um, armoured swordsmen. If you look, dismount of feudals cost 225 to maintain, whereas our armoured swordsmen only cost 150. So, you, make sure you keep building stuff. Uh, I, should, I don't want to do too much, because I don't want to end up in a situation with no logic item. <clears throat> I don't want to end up in a situation with no uh, no money. Took me a minute. I'm going to leave you there for the time being because that guy spooks me. Um, I mean, I could dispense some of those knights. How much was I in debt by? Five thousand from. I'm losing a lot from corruption still. Um, well, yeah, how much was I? How much here? That's, what, a thousand? A thousand and a bit? We'll see how we do next turn in terms of economics. Orders, uh, but we took Angus. So that's good. We'll have to put some troops in it to replace some of them. Uh, this guy doesn't look too bad. To What's he got? In fact, show me what this guy's got as well. Town Militia and Pilgrims. I think we can manage that. What about this guy? Bog all. Okay, perfect. That won't be too difficult to deal with. 
down in Tunis. Uh, you get to the port. We have lots of trade routes going out, which is nice. We train that lot, though I think that's only giving them better equipment. Um, we'll just siege that out, we're in no rush. Okay, uh, cool. I think let's end the turn. I'd like to take Bruges at some point, but we'll cross that bridge eventually. Um, give me some of those guys for the time being. This guy does worry me a little bit, but it's not too bad. Mostly pilgrims. A boon for builders. Okay. Oh, the wheelbarrow. By placing a wheel at the front of a wooden stretcher, a uh, lone worker with heavy loads of stone on their own. Very nice. Uh, take Bruges. Okay. About time you gave me that mission. I've been wanting it for ages. Your Majesty. Okay. Sicily. Did you expect us to be happy to see you? Why is it very demanding? How could you ask this? I don't get it. Why it's like oh, very demanding. Well, you can't do anything to me. I, I outrank you in nearly every capacity. Yet you're still like, no, no peace. Fine. Oh, it feels unappreciated. No surprise he's stuck down in Tunis. You know, ready, I could, I could go and drop off a bunch of troops over there. Um, I will need to leave some people behind though, maybe the pilgrims. Hmm. Another problem actually. I don't know what's around here in terms of yes, my liege. hidden enemy this armies. So we do need to go and build towers. There we go. Will keep vigil over the lands. Camp here, uh, this guy, he does worry me. Yes, my lord. I am not going to lie, I am concerned about him. Looks like he's going to go after Cairn. Which is annoying. Okay, those Danes are still there. You go here. Yes, sir. I never like sailing anyway. <laughs> Command me, sire. Well, enter there. Um, in fact, we'll just take some of these guys out. Sire. 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 Orders. Need more front line there, really. Orders. And we'll leave some of the cavalry behind. Mm. I think that'll do. Because that guy shouldn't be too much of trouble. And then we'll put him about here, just to uh, act threatening. I mean, they might still attack me. But we'll have merchant wharfs up soon. Uh, okay. I think we end the turn. We'd have to take Bruges, but we can get this guy to go after Bruges if we need to. Are you trying to give me an order? Hmm. I think we'll be alright. I'm a bit worried about those Danes in that boat, but we'll see what comes of it. We've got to bring this guy back around here, to be honest. Oh, I need to build a new merchant as well, don't I, at some point. Okay. Sack it for the cash. Victory, my liege. Uh, hero of zero. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Of no value. Okay. Not exactly sure what that's talking about, but fair enough. Yes. The Spanish do worry me, as I've said before. It looks like he's actually going after Bruges. I don't think he'll be able to take that. What's in Paris? Where to, sire? I really wish I had another spy around here. Sire. I should really Where build to, one. Sire? Of course, sire. Lots of peasants. An 
order. I mean, I'm at war with them, so I really should attack them. And just get through it. But we'll just have to see. Uh, feels unappreciated, no surprise. Again, he's out in the middle of nowhere. Um, <clears throat> put you back in Tunis for the time being. But yeah, we do need to take some of these guys out and send them across to Sicily. Because we're at war, we might as well take them out. You know, we could even jump from Tunis to um, <clears throat> Palmo and then Naples if we wanted to. But anyway, we've hit 30 minutes. In fact, we're over it now, so I have to end the part here. Hopefully you all have enjoyed, and I shall see you all next time.